France riots, fourth day of unrest. France is in turmoil as violent clashes and looting continue for the fourth day. Rioters confront the police, loot stores, and set fires in multiple cities across the country. In Strasbourg, an Apple store was looted, and tear gas shells were fired at rioters. Paris saw smashed windows at a fast food outlet and an attempted break-in at a closed store. Marseille experienced a second night of unrest with projectiles thrown, fires set, and shops looted. Lyon suburbs witnessed arson, clashes with police, and an unauthorized protest against police violence. President Emmanuel Macron deployed an additional 5,000 officers, bringing the total to 45,000. Interior Minister Gerald Darmanin made 1,300 arrests and implemented a nighttime shutdown of public buses and trams. He also banned the sale and carrying of powerful fireworks and flammable substances. Darmanin warned social media networks against inciting violence and urged their cooperation in identifying promoters of violence. The riot spread to French overseas territories, resulting in casualties and damage. President Macron called for collaboration with technology companies to remove sensitive content. The United Kingdom, United States, and other countries issued travel warnings for France. The unrest began after a teenager was killed by a police officer, sparking protests and unrest. President Macron expressed solidarity with the victim's family and emphasized the importance of justice.